In today's video, we're gonna take a look at a very unusual piece of equipment. Now, in this case, unusual is a good thing because what you're looking at here is a multi-function machine. Now, it looks like a backpack blower, but it actually can do three different jobs with this one machine. Now, if you've watched some of my other videos, you know I'm a big fan of spraying for mosquitoes. I also love to use a backpack blower, but the greatest thing of all is actually the price. It's very affordable, and for what they've put in one package, I think this could really be an excellent machine for just about any homeowner. Here's a video I made last year that was designed to help homeowners save money and be able to get rid of things like ticks, mosquitoes, spiders, and all sorts of other problem insects that were on the yards or in their lawns. Now this system works great and it involves two components. The first is that chemical I have in my hands there. That stuff is called Demand CS and you'd be surprised to treat my entire yard for a year only cost about 50 bucks. But the problem is it needs to be sprayed in a different way than you use most products. And that's what that piece of equipment is behind me made by steel. Now that's a backpack mister. And this thing is expensive. It's way over 500 bucks. And I got a lot of great comments about the video because people don't want mosquitoes and ticks, but they can't afford to spend that kind of money. It only really does one job. It's just gonna do things like spraying for bugs. And that makes it even more expensive for a homeowner because if you wanna do things like blowing leaves, you've got to go out and basically buy another piece of equipment. So that's what got me thinking about trying to find a less expensive way that people could apply it. This is exactly where my search led me. Now to fuel this thing up, you've got to use two stroke. And if you don't know what that means, that just means that you mix gas and oil together. And this is identical to the steel. They use the exact same kind of fuel. It's got these heavily padded straps on the unit. They're thick and they work very well. And oftentimes when you get a budget piece of gear, you don't always get things like this, but I liked the way they did this. All the controls are right here at your fingertips. You've got the throttle right there, the on and off, and you've even got a throttle lock. So once you get this thing up to the speed you want, you can actually hold it in with that lever on the side. Now this other thing right here is actually a liquid valve. So when you're gonna spray things like that chemical, you wanna be able to start and stop the spray and that's exactly what that valve does. And this is the business end of this thing when it's not running. Now it kind of looks like a little bit of a jet engine because that thing can rotate. And when you start the machine up and air starts going through along with the chemical, that's gonna help make sure that it comes out evenly. In this valve on the end is exactly how you control how much chemical comes out. You just pick the setting you want and you're ready to go. Now let's give the machine a try. Now to get started, we're gonna put some liquid in the machine. And other things that I like right away is this cap on it is very large, it's easy to get off. It's got a good rubber O-ring in there and it's also got a strainer which is handy because many times you're gonna pour something in there that's not supposed to go in. For the sake of the demo, I'm just gonna use water but I wanted to make it a little bit more visible on the camera so we're gonna do something a bit different and here I'm gonna add a special product called a colorant. Now if you've watched my other videos, I use this quite often because anytime you're gonna spray anything on your yard or your trees and you want to be able to tell where you've been using one of these dyes can be so helpful because it doesn't cause any problem to the plant or your environment and in fact if you even get it on your driveway or concrete it'll wash off in just a few days to usually a week starting this is really easy you just step on the frame on the bottom pump up the primer bulb a few times and then just give it a pull now this thing started right up for me and i was really surprised how easily it started Here's a great trick too, that these things can weigh a lot when they're filled up and you'd be shocked at how heavy they are. So by putting this on a set of stairs like this or in the back of a pickup, now when I stand up, it's a lot less distance to travel and that really saves my back. Begin spraying is just like the steel. You just have to flip that valve and the chemical will come out the end. Squeeze the throttle and now you can see that fine mist coming out. And this is exactly what you want for this kind of treatment. You can spray things like leaves, pine needles, even your lawn, and it works really well because you're gonna get a very even coating. And this is exactly why you need a piece of equipment like this. If you want to spray for bugs or anything like that in your lawn, you want to put down a fine mist. Because when you're doing a fine mist, what that means is that you're going to use less product and get a more even result. And especially with the dye in here, you can really see how much area I can cover. You could never do this with any sort of a pump sprayer. Included with the same machine is the ability to apply dry products. You can do things like DE and a whole lot more, but this is another great use out of this same machine. But this machine is easy to clean up. Now the steel works exactly the same way. You just simply fill it up with clean water and spray the clean water out and it'll totally clean out the machine. Now if you're using very difficult chemicals, you may need to do this two or three times, but it just takes about a minute or so each time, so it's really fast and easy. 
And now on a feature that the steel doesn't even have, you can actually convert this thing from a mister to a regular backpack leaf blower. Now that's the best part because you can do this in under one minute. All you've got to do is take a hose off, change the end, and now this thing's a really capable leaf blower. Now if you're concerned about the weight, that tank really doesn't add much at all when it's empty. It's when it's full that you feel that weight. But by changing this around, now you can increase the versatility. And I found this to be a pretty good blower and a good power and it was easy to use but the biggest thing for you if you're a homeowner is that you can actually get more than one function out of this thing this machine is fantastic for somebody that wants to control insects mosquitoes ticks or anything else in your yard you also could use it to spray products on your lawn as well I really was surprised at how well this machine performed considering I'm comparing it to the steel now in terms of using it as a leaf blower it did a good job now it is a little bit bigger than a regular unit so this may not be your first choice if you were just going to use it as a backpack blower but again the point of this thing is that it's multifunctional so if you want to get one machine that's not much more expensive than a backpack backpack blower and you can control insects this thing is an absolute bargain and that's what the point of this video was for and you should be aware that this is an imported product and what matters the most for something like that is that you can get parts and support and that's why I picked this Tomahawk brand because if you look at the reviews online this is the only brand that actually stands behind the product and will supply parts and national warranty coverage now this thing is pretty cheap but it still is good to know that you can actually get through to somebody if you want to reach out so I hope this video was helpful to you. It gives you an option if you want to get a backpack blower or you're thinking about doing insect control and you needed a mister. It's nice to be able to get an all-in-one unit that can actually do the job. And the best part, of course, is the price. And unlike my video last year, at least if you want to get into this space, now it's a lot more affordable. So I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for more videos coming up.